apologize because I ain't supposed to bang that guy, and that's why I learned it. I'm kind of going back to these things that we glazed over, and I was probably paying attention. But, uh... Okay, well, let's get into something I know will get your attention, because you brought it up before we started recording. The RIM phones. <laughs> yeah, that London, the, what is it, the Blackberry London looks awesome. It's a front-facing camera, a rear face, you know, I was like, hey, this looks great. It doesn't have a hard keyboard, but I can get past that if I have a, a playbook to attach it to, you know what I'm saying? So this is a, a good thing. I, I, I don't know. It, it's BlackBerry. I think has some recovery work to do, but I, their shares were temporarily. I posted it today. Their shares temporarily beat Apple. That's you know that's a nice recovery from almost col from having a minor <laughs> collapse the other week. <laughs> and information, man. I hate. I always look to my right because. I'm on the Windows machine and my Mac is in front of me. I hate doing that. I'm trying to break that out because people are probably like, what the hell am I looking at? <laughs> I'm looking at my Skype video to make sure I'm in the camera, which is on my Windows 7 machine. And I'm on the show notes on my Mac Pro, which is directly in front of me. <laughs> <laughs> and some people like to go that way. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Scarecrow. It's <laughs> like... I, I don't know. The, the phones are I think, I think if RIM gets it right with all the services ready to roll, BBX, which I, I really, I think that I've demoed the playbook. I think it's great. And if they've got everything in place, they're, they're going to make a comeback. Trust me. I, I, here's the thing I think is absolutely a minimum for RIM to make that comeback. They have got to convince developers, either by bribes or just providing a really good platform for them to rapidly produce uh, productivity apps. For BlackBerry yes. users, it's productivity apps. Not yeah. games, not, not productivity. I can get more work done on yeah. my rim. Yeah. yeah. And because of the reputation... Does not support all the features of Google Docs. Say that again. Oh my god! This is total horse crap. Your browser does not support all. I just got this uh, in the show notes. It's orange now. Uh, <laughs> what browser are you on? I'm, I'm using Firefox. Which version? Uh, let me see. That's a good question. What am I on? Oh, darn it. Hold on. Help about. <laughs> Quickly. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, hold on, I'm on this other thing. Uh, hold on, i got to close this out. <clears throat> I have noticed that oh, you're... Firefox. I'm on Firefox 5. That should be new enough. It's not the latest and greatest, but... <laughs> yeah, what the hell Firefox are we on now? Firefox 7. <laughs> and I don't even think I'm that's on, the no, latest. No, no, I'm on five. This is Firefox 5. This is, I mean, this is, uh... uh there's not really a sufficient difference between Firefox 4 no, and Firefox 7. Try, no, here's, what, here's, 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 the, here's the punchline. Try Google Chrome. I bet it works seamlessly. I hate Google Chrome. You know that? I'm sorry. What, the browser or...? The, the browser. It uses too much resources. I, you know, I figured out what that is. Um, it, it's actually very lightweight until you get it past a certain front point, but once you get it past a certain point and tabs and other things running, oh the, no, the, it, fact, so crap. the fact that they have basically made it like an OS-like, where it has its own task manager and everything's internalized, you have things duplicated, because yeah, they're all running internally sure. inside of Chrome, rather yeah. than, and, like, and that, that's, that's the thing I don't like about Chrome and Chromium. There's other things I don't like about it too, but that particular thing, it does bug me a little bit. But it is a pretty good WebKit browser, as long as you're not doing too many things with it. it it's made for a mono sense. Um, while we're on the topic of browsers, Bob. <laughs> yes, he's Bob. I have to call him Bob. He comes from the net, don't you know? <laughs> Anything to contribute, Bob? <laughs> to what? The conversation about 
about web browser or is the conversation about the uh, rim phone? Pick <laughs> one! <laughs> um, uh, Bit, what's your biggest issue other than resources with Chrome? Well, that was my that was my main issue, to be honest. I mean, it, that on my Mac and my Windows machines, that it creates these independent sessions that just juice the shit out of the machines that I'm just not interested in, essentially. Once it once it once you once you piss me off as a browser that I have to like close you that because like my CPUs have gone insane. Uh, <laughs> True. Multiple accounts, which I guess people could say happens with them with. Flash on the Mac. Uh, <laughs> I, I no longer use you. <laughs> you know, am I the only one who wants a WebKit-based browser with built-in sandboxing so I can, you know, basically compartmentalize my browsing and say, you know what, you page, no JavaScript, no Flash, but it's like I have it on an individual session page, yada yada set basis, rather than all off or all on. Because it, 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 we've gotten to the point as we're trying to do everything to the browser, you almost need that to keep it from bogging your system down if you're doing too many things. Yeah. I, I also, let me also say this. Chrome is not the favorite layout for me as well. I'm a big fan. Even though the new Firefox, you can kind of edit it. I like the URL bar where it is and, and the tabs like below it. Yeah, yeah that, that's, that, that's my two things. My two things with with Chrome, it, uh, Chrome and Chromium, is there's no good way to move your tabs to the side, which is kind of a, something I need for the number of tabs I open. I do not want to be sitting there going, okay, and we're now we're scrolling to this tab, or we're opening this other thing, which I then have to scroll through. I want them tree grouped. Uh, and, yeah, if I want my menu things, yeah. And also, I'll be honest, I'm pretty much now locked into Firefox. I'm not going to get off my lazy ass. Well, oh, there's been now Firefox has created a problem though now because they've switched yeah. over to the Chrome numbering system. It's cre and they're trying to change the way add-ons that what made oh, Firefox yeah. so utilitarian was that and now they're trying to kind of minimize that. I'm like, no, Mozilla, stop! Go back! <laughs> yeah, I, I, I have synchronization that happens across my work uh, uh, and my W2 job here and there. I mean, I have so much now that synchronizes automatically that I, I don't, I, I can't see myself using any other browser until I, I, I don't feel lazy and I, and I can just, you know, transfer, which I'm sure is pretty easy to do. I know Chrome will do the import. And I can't then probably they have a syn synchronizing service I'm sure with Chrome. But then again, Google pisses me off. <laughs> you know, I, I don't, I'm not giving him my goddamn phone number and my address and you know what what type I need. But you must! We have to know yeah. your child's firstborn name. I agree with you. I, that's I, honestly, some of the questions Google tries to associate with your... And you know what? I would be less paranoid about it. I'd still be a little paranoid about it. But because it's Google and the sheer number of places they can track me around the web and the metrics they provide for everybody and the things they can... And like, I'm sorry. Google, you know too much about me already. I don't want yeah. to give you anything that unanonymizes it any more than it already is. Exactly. And, and that <laughs> is a very strong point of the Apple family. Is that, oh, you know, Apple, yeah, they have a walled garden, but at least it, their business model is not about pushing ads to you. And then knowing every little thing about you to, to, to push the correct ad to you. That is a very dangerous game. Because... To do that, and your business model is all about what to sell you as an advertisement, requires far more intelligence. And, and, that, and you know, honestly, that's problem. not the bit I, I I inherently have a problem with. The problem with it, I have with that is Google does not understand the idea that my life is compartmentalized. 
I'm in one oh, mode. God. Yeah, I, I'm in one mode over here. I'm in another mode over here. I may love snowboarding. It doesn't mean I want to see it when I'm at work. Doesn't mean I want anything. You proved my point. Thank you. That's what I'm saying. Yes, I mean, they, but that's their job. If that's their business model, they gotta know everything about you, man. And and that's that's the dangerous game we play. It's uh, how much. What it was that Benjamin Franklin had said. You know, those of us. Those that who will trade liberty for security. Yeah, you know, I don't know. Uh, I, I don't like the the apples walled garden at all. I'm not a fan of it. Uh, it you know, I've always been one to argue, but that's why I'm not really an Android owner anymore either. You know, I'm not I'm not happy with the Android model as it is. Uh, so I don't know my, my big problem with what you're getting on with Google as of late is that ever increasingly they're hiding the option to opt out, which means unless you're a sophisticated user, you're not aware that you even have the option to opt out. You, you, you have to, and, and I'm noticing that more and more, it's unobvious that it isn't required. And people are just assuming, well, I don't really want to, but I guess because it's required, but it isn't. But it's implied that it's required. You know, yes, they make it, exactly, they make these big freaking screens. Like, oh, and red. Oh, my God, provide us your phone number. Kiss my ass. I wish we could type that in. Kiss my ass. Well, you saw what my name was before I had a Google Plus. <laughs> it's like in my old emails and stuff, you know. It's it's like sad. <laughs> so sad, man. <laughs> Damn. Uh, well, it, it, you know that 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 plays havoc because I mean, literally, this Google account is not this Google account is not this Google. I I, I have I, I'm one of these evil people that has multiple Google accounts. I need to pause and see this video. Now I need a drink because now I'm getting depressed. So now, so now I need a drink. We need to pause to save this video before it crashes. I, I